Hello again, my dear friend. Uh, thank you for your extra patience. <coughs> uh, after after uh, briefly introducing the steps produced by the uh, uh, provided by the staff of OGT Media Manufacturer regarding the first body upgrading the system. Yeah, uh, upgrade the system using force. Uh, now I decide to try the the process by myself. Now I, I share with you my my installation. Of course, this is the Win Nine Super device. Uh, this one uh, the same as yours, and I have <coughs> already plugged the USB uh, drive uh, USB disk inside the USB interface of of my device. Uh, before before inserting into the USB interface as as displayed in my video one. I ha have already copied the .abs file into the root directory of this USB disk. And this USB disk was cleared before copying operation. So it only contains the only .abs file under the root directory of this, of this device. Okay. So, uh, because currently I do not have a TV at hand, so I decide to use this uh, portable projector as my displaying tool. Uh, it will project all pictures and videos to the wall as a screen. Yeah, and uh, as we can see, I have already connected the HDMI cable with both interfaces of the projector and also the um, V9 Super device. Now I have already plugged into the socket, but I do not power on it. And furthermore, before I, I recording this video, I have already installed one pair of the matching battery inside. So now it's powered, yeah. So now it's powered, yeah. And this is the menu button. This is very important for us to do the first upgrading procedures. Uh, because when when I power on the V9 Super device after being plugged into the USB disk with the .abs file, I need to frequently I I need to continuously press the menu button to force the device access the page of uh, upgrading. Okay, uh, let's go back to the topic and I will do it. First, I will power on this projector. Yeah. Okay, now projector has already uh, started. But uh, as we, we know, as we know, uh, this V9 Super device has not been powered on. I do not uh, press this button. So now no signal exists. And uh, at the same time, I will I will power on the V9 Super device. At the same time, uh, I will continuously press the menu button on the remote. That will be very important. Okay, I will press it. to force okay now as we can see uh, I have already access the upgrade mode now in fact it's a uh, force upgrading mode uh, upgrade mode all code upgrade uh, file v9 super 2019-0328.abs and now start now there's a bar shows uh, zero percent yeah I will use my remote to choose to choose to start to start it yeah i will i will i will start it i will click ok i will click ok now uh, uh, let me stress it this is the a dot abs file that i have copied under the root directory of my usb disk yeah I will click start. Uh, do not remove U disk. 
right? And now attention, let, let me read it. Uh, attention, after the software up updates the receiver, we are reset to factory default. Favorite lists and other personal settings will be deleted and should be saved before. If you want to continue, select OK. Of course, I, I select uh, yes. I press OK. OK, OK. Now the, the upgrading process should be running. Should be running. Uh, I, I suppose it, it's quite OK. It's quick. And uh, to achieve a good view, I decide to shut down my night because uh, now I'm using the remoter, yeah. It disappear, uh, it shows better. And uh, at, sim at the same time, I decide to remove off, <coughs> I decide to remove off this USB, uh, it's stuck, yeah. This USB device of the USB interface. And uh, let me uh, do some simple operation. Yeah, maybe, uh, as we can see, this device has already been upgraded through using this way under the steps provided by the staff of GT Media. Yeah, in fact, it's true. And uh, uh, we can connect uh, the network through the SLED, I guess so. Network cable or Wi-Fi, or Wi-Fi connecting, yeah. Then we can choose our local Wi-Fi. Then connect to uh, connect the, with the cable uh, with the valid Wi-Fi signal on or, or this room. Yeah, and some other simple operation may be processed. I guess so. And uh, language information now is free set V9 Super, etc. Uh, etc. Et yeah. And uh, there exists the software upgrade, upgrade by USB, upgrade by network. Uh, this, uh, this, this both upgrading ways shall be processed under the normal, normal status. As to as to us, we shall have to first body uh, upgrade it through that way because we cannot access uh, the the main menu normally. Uh, in fact, this is my first uh, try to upgrade uh, this V9 Super device using force, using force, yeah. So, but luckily it's successful. So, my friend, you can get, uh, I will share you, with you all the information, including the .abs file and uh, some other information. And then you can take uh, some short time to have a try. Uh, I guess that issue shall be solved. Yeah, of course, if you have some further issues, even after this try, yeah, some further issues exist, uh, let me know, and I may contact uh, the GT Mania manufacturer further in a responsible way, uh, or yeah, we will do some other things based on completely uh, responsibility. No problem, no problem. Thank you for your time. Alexander from Shasky. Bye bye.